Badamusi reacts to a report alleging that Tinubu's health condition is currently in a critical state. Hmm. Because we saw that since he came back from uh, the United Nations General Assembly in the United States and then uh, made the national broadcast on the Nigerian Independence Day, we've not seen him in the public setting till now. Okay. And now uh, there's, there are speculations that his health condition is bad and it's in a critical state and only god knows where he is and this led to uh you know to one of the uh arise television news anchors uh, ruben abati asking where is our president where is tinubu and who has seen him in recent times you know and that is still the concern up to now um ruben abati started asking where is mr president who has seen him we need to know where our president is okay why some are speculating that he's sick he has gone to take treatment he's in a he's in a sorry state and all of that so in all of these speculations and information and rumors in the public space but Amosi has come out to say something about it let's dive into the details and hear what he has to say but Amosi has recently taken to his social media handles to react to reports alleging that president bola Tinubu uh Balatinubu's health condition is currently in a critical uh, state hmm. you could recall that a popular twitter page released uh a tweet emphasizing that there are reports that Tinubu's health condition is being in a critical state currently and that he is on emergency life support below is a screen capture of the tweet now what was it? they say peter will be grassroots mobilization the report of Tinubu's health condition being in a critical state currently and believed to be on emergency life support is sad. Uh, it's a sad one. Okay, it is time for Nigeria to carry out critical health check for anyone contesting public office in Nigeria. We can't continue to circulate sick and old people at the affairs of our leadership. Hmm. So he went for that to say, however, but I mostly why reacting said that such reports should be discountenanced. In addition, but I mostly made this statement in a recent post he made via his official Twitter handle. Quoting the original statement he shared on Twitter, he said this, discountenance this report immediately. This has been his tactic for garnering public sympathy since his days as Lagos state uh, governor. This latest episode is because of Chicago State exposing him and the forthcoming FBI release of 2,500 pages out of its 70,000 page file. Meanwhile, take a look at the screen capture of the post he, sh he shared on Twitter. Discontinuous this report immediately. Okay, Baba Tunde Guaramosi. This has been his tactic of garnering public sympathy since his days as Lagos State Governor. The latest episode is because of Chicago State's exposing him and the forthcoming FBI release of 2,500 pages out of his 7,000 page. Hmm. The report of Tunubu's health condition being in the critical state currently and believed to be in emergency life support is a sad, sad one. Okay, and it is time to for Nigerians to carry out critical health check for anyone contesting uh, public office hmm. so that was actually the twitter and but i'm mostly speaking on it and but i'm going to say anyways over to you my dear readers what are your thoughts concerning this uh, this uh, issue <laughs> now be smart you know so what is but i'm mostly speaking now is this supporting tinubu and that is what it is it's going to support tinubu because that is uh is uh probably is i don't know okay so but where is Tinubu in the first place? So if people are speculating, just like it came out last week uh, that Gowan had passed on, you know, and it was circulated throughout the media. And why people were, you know, beginning to believe it, Gowan came out and said, I'm very, very much around, very, very much alive. I'm not in a hurry to go. I am alive, you know. And that put that speculation to rest immediately. That is what we expect people like Tinubu to do. 
If there's a speculation that your health condition is bad and you are on a life support, to come out and tell Nigerians is a lie. And by not by recorded video, come out and say it openly, okay, on a live television and say it's a lie. I am here, I'm much around. I just wanted to keep quiet and rest. Then people will know, yes, he's around. But speculations are moving and he's not anywhere to come and uh, do something about it. Eh? This is a very bad one. Not, not a very good one for Nigeria as a country at all. So let's see. People are already reacting to that Twitter page and to what Baba Tunde Beramusi said. Someone said, as the CSU saga is becoming cold, when I don't bring another conspiracy, Nigeria and cruise seriously. Can you imagine? Somebody said, exactly. You have spoken my mind. Don't mind the jobless people. Okay. Oh. Um, then, some other person is insulting others. It's stupid people. The same way you people mourn Buhari alive when your parents are dying. Why he, while he is still alive? Okay, can you imagine? God gives and God takes. So I say, where there is smoke sooner than later, can you imagine? Fire, where there is smoke sooner than later, fire will follow next. Better believe it. Buhari is full of need and they survived by lies and loyalty. But Yorubas are pretty what? Pretenders will stab, stab you in the back. Igbos are independent and arrogant and demand equality. <laughs> Can you imagine? That's a good analysis. But you don't mind, I'm always happy to hear somebody fell sick or died. <coughs> All of you should wait for annoyance of God. <laughs> what is annoyance of God there? Okay. The Lord Almighty will strengthen, heal, and take away any form of illness from him to enable him face anything that he needs to face. You can you imagine? Okay. So, somebody say busy bodies, they will continue to will till eternity. Gullible, closed minded human beings. The Lord is his strength. Recovery shall come his way. Okay. We know better about his condition. is sick. Eh? Even one is not the one ruling Nigeria. It's CSO like PMB and Kiari. <laughs> now, wow. So now, people are coming out to challenge the rumor, challenge the speculation. But we don't know where Mr. President is as we speak. He needs to come and say it by himself that he's active, he's alive. And it's somewhere, he's here, he's there, and Nigeria will be okay. That is it. Nigerians are waiting to hear from him. That is it. Just like uh, now they are trying to insult uh, uh, Igbos in this matter, but Ruben Abati has come out from Arise TV to say, Where is Mr. President? Where is President Tulubu? Where Who has seen him in recent times? Since he came back for the United Nations General Assembly and did national broadcast during the Nigerian independence. We have not heard from him. We have not seen him. Who has seen him? Up to now, nobody has answered that question in APC, even in the Kaba, because right now, the government is ruling by Kaba. Okay? The government is ruling by Kaba. But nobody wants to ask Ruben Abati, why are you calling for Mr. President to come out? But now, others are speaking, they are chasing the, the Igbos. The travel by God in this country is what is going to destroy the country completely. So thank you for listening and let's have your comment.